फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई एम डूइंग एन एक्सपेरिमेंटल वीडियो अबाउट द रूटिंग हॉर्न पाउडर हाउ इट वर्क्स रियली इट वर्क्स ऑन नॉट हाउ यू कैन अप्लाई इट्स ऑन योर कटिंग्स आई एम टेकिंग कटिंग्स ऑफ क्रिशन थम ए नंबर ऑफ अराउंड फोर्टी टू फिफ्टी कटिंग्स आई एम टेकिंग दिस इज नॉट द सीजन ऑफ क्रिशन थमाम कटिंग बट जस्ट टू टेक द एक्सपेरिमेंट just to run the experiment i am taking these cuttings so here i have collected around 40 to 50 cuttings of chrysanthemum just to show how the rooting hormone powder is to used and how its efficacy so this is the cutting edge powder rooting hormone powder this is available in the market you can get a number of uh, brands in rooting hormone powder online so this is the white powder and you can see this contains indole acetic acid indole butyric acid this kinds of oxin hormone and for the cuttings i am soaking it water the base is soaking in water and sticking the rooting hormone powder and this is a sand all river sand and uh, soaked in water and uh, i am making some holes with the help of some old pen used pen so that the plants can be grown properly because the sand is very very hard so we have to make some holes and sticking the rooting hormone powder at the base around 1 inch and pushing this cuttings in in the so, uh, sand and you can see i am growing around 20 to 25 cuttings in this chali and uh, these are used for rooting hormone powder and in one chali i'll apply no, i won't apply any kind of rooting hormone powder so this is an experiment and uh, after 12 days i will show the experimental results so how rooting hormone powder works it really works or not and how much the difference of uh, application of rooting hormone powder and uh, use non use of rooting hormone powder in cuttings so you can use in any of the cuttings maybe soft cutting semi hard cuttings hard cuttings any kind of plants you can cuttings you can grow in rooting hormone powder and here in this chali so i will be growing this cutting directly without rooting hormone powder without using rooting hormone powder directly pushing it down inside the sand river sand sand is soaked in water properly and water is sprayed properly in the sand and i'll keep them in under semi shade area for 12 to 15 days and uh, you have to water it every day you have to sprinkle water it every day because the sand should be moist every time and friends i have grown all these cuttings and after growing the cuttings i'll sprinkle little bit of water on it just see don't add much water A little bit of water will work, and now I will keep it in semi shade area for around twelve to fifteen days, and sprinkle water every day, and I will see the results after twelve days. What is the result, and what is the different of difference of application of rooting hormone powder and non application of rooting hormone powder, and let's see the results after twelve days. Friends, welcome back after twelve days, and you can see in your right hand these are all application of rooting hormone powder, and these are all without rooting hormone powder results. And results you can see without rooting hormone powder they are grown less, and this is the rooting hormone powder application. Already buds are coming because these are winter season, and early buds are appearing. I am pinching up the buds because they won't grow. and now i'll show the difference these are the very very fine and plants grows are very nice here the plant growth is very less sometimes and a little bit of already died that i am removed and here you can see every plant saplings cuttings have grown and i am pulling it with the application of used pen uh, from the root area you have to pull it so that all the root ball comes out you can see beautiful roots and wherever the rooting hormone powder has touched and we are seeing everywhere the uh, roots have grown and very very good result i have kept in an inverted uh, pot so that the water can come out properly and uh, plants can grow properly now i'll show you the and uh, other soft cuttings also and see the results enormous growth of roots in every sphere of you can see 
all are full of roots. And I tell you, 100% cutting has been successful here. And all with beautiful base roots. How you can grow the cutting, that I will also show. And these are the non-application of rooting hormone powder. Here, root now have not uh, appeared. And uh, again, here, roots have appeared in less in number. If you grow cuttings without rooting hormone, that also do. But here, you can see the difference. In your left hand, this is rooting hormone powder application and without rooting hormone powder you can see the results and uh, around 50 percent success you can get in rooting hormone powder and the uh, roots will be much lesser if you apply without rooting hormone powder and here you can see in every rooting uh, cuttings you can see beautiful uh, roots have grown and uh, this is the result difference and uh, i'll pot it in one and a half inch pot I am taking only plain soil, no fertilizer used in this soil and only in plain soil and I am growing in one and a half inch pot, how to grow it one and a half inch pot and uh, after the growing keep it in semi shade area, water it properly, how the water you can apply, I will show you how to apply water in, uh, let me plant all this. I am taking 5 pots here and 5 cuttings I will grow and I will show the how to water them properly. After uh, growing this in cuttings in 1 and a half inch pot, you have to keep it in semi shade area for 3 to 4 days and then you can keep it in open sunlight. So let me pot properly and I will show the watering system. In 2 days you can water, you can apply water directly with a sprinkler or you can dip in a bucket full of water dip the whole pot this is the first way of watering and the second way of watering take a bucket full bucket of water dip it inside and take it up and they will take all the waters from the bucket and uh, you have to do it once only and after that you can keep this uh, in semi shade area i'll report this all these uh, plants in one and a half inch pot and uh, this is the difference we can see application of rooting hormone powder and non-application of rooting hormone this is the application of rooting hormone powder you can see the root growth here uh, beautiful roots are grown but in without rooting hormone powder roots have not formed properly and the number of roots are here you can see beautiful roots have grown here but without rooting hormone powder you cannot see good quality of rooting, uh, rooting here so this is the different i am shown and this is only oxygen hormone if you can apply you can get best results hope you this find this valuable and useful and uh, please subscribe my channel thank you